I remember you. I remember you, and I'm gonna trample all over your face for trampling over Nidori, Yuka, and Marissa. Don't think I won't remember, because I will. Jerk face. Hey there, people of the internet world. It's Kibatu. Welcome back to Let's Play Toho Mother. Nidori wanted us to come here because there were things happening here in Yokai Mountain. So, why don't we go ahead and take a look around and see if we can't help her out in exploring Yokai Mountain. At least I'm to believe this is Yokai Mountain. I wouldn't imagine this being anywhere else, to be honest. But, who knows. Um, I don't think there's anything up here. Just a way up and a way down. Okay. Doesn't make sense, but alright. Um, I think, if I recall correctly, there are a couple of places here that you can't exactly, um, explore and find out about, in particular. I'm not fully sure... The horror. The unimaginable horror. Let's open it again! I don't know if Raymu's laughing to herself that hard, or she just found it horrible. But either way, I found it hilarious that, she, that it happened, because it happened. Yeah, what's going on here? This is supposed to be an upper level, and then that's a lower level, and then we're walking across the rope to get across, and... You know what? Video game, video game logic. Don't question it. Barkeep? <laughs> oh, you know what? I gotta show that to somebody. That's a pretty hilarious comment there. <laughs> uh, especially in a game like this. That's, uh, that's pretty hilarious. Okay, I think... What's an ant doing here? Uh, I guess we shouldn't step on him. So, let's be nice and not step on him. In the meantime, we're gonna go... We're gonna be climbing downward in a circular motion through this cavern, I guess? Either we're climbing down a cave? I completely lost my turn of thought. Oh, um, either we're climbing down... Oh, come on. I'm gonna start bopping them senseless. Also, Yuka's behind me instead of Marissa. How did that happen? Did Marissa, like... Did I not see that Marissa just kind of switched around while I wasn't looking or something? Ah, uh, uh, This is kind of trippy. Anyway, going down this way and grab this. Ooh, explosive. Secret sword, I guess, is Yuka's. I'm still waiting for a sequel. <laughs> what? Uh, what? Uh, alright. I think there's... Yeah, this is a corner. Yeah, this is just a corner of nothingness. Except for a boss battle or a, a enemy counter. So, yeah, that was worthless. So, let's just keep going. I guess we're going up then. I could have sworn we went down on the other path. I could have sworn that, at least. Um, something to know, you will want to try and not run into so many battles here, because a lot of these are going to take a lot of PP from you. What? This game confuses me sometimes.
I'm gonna toss Eatery down the thing. She's acting crazy. <laughs> a lot more crazier than I expected. Uh, Eatery, Eatery's still pretty cool, though. As weird as she is, she's still pretty cool. So, yeah, I guess we're climbing up. How weird. I could have sworn we climbed down on the first floor. At least I thought we did. I could be wrong. But oh well. I do want to know one more thing. I'm going the wrong way. I did want to know one more thing, though. If, um, if you heal and the battle ends, they are instantly fully healed. So that's nice. I kind of learned that as soon as I tried to heal the Marissa and her, her HP kept going up slowly. While as soon as the battle ended, it just instantly went to full HP. So that's nice. I like that. I kind of appreciate that. The heck? What is this? Energy charm. Yes! That's an energy thing from Metroid. Interesting enough. I'm gonna go ahead and save real quick while I'm thinking about it because, oh wow. <laughs> Alright, so, what's up ahead? Oh, wait a minute! <gasps> no! It's that thing! Yuka's not very fond of the jokes between Marissa and Nitori. So, yeah. Oh well. Yeah, in case you haven't noticed yet, this thing looks a lot like that creature in Genius of Sapphiros. And if that's the case, then I'm already scared for this party. But, I guess we gotta fight on. Because nobody else is ever gonna do it. Alrighty, so first things first, we gotta shield ourselves up, and you can, you can just keep attacking. Double machine gun! Not bad. So yeah, put shields on both Marissa. Oh, it healed? Really? No, no, darn it. Marissa? Tell me, throw me a bone here. Wow, this thing has a thing for stats. Oh, nice to Alright, so everyone's shielded up, good to go. So... Ugh. The problem with this guy, though, is that he has a tendency to break shields. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's a problem. I do want to try and keep Marissa with the shields as well. Because him doing 20, 30 damage per pop, that's kind of dangerous. Especially to somebody that has low HP like Marissa. Holy crap, you do not like Reimu. Okay, Reimu needs to heal up. I don't think, Mar I don't think Reimu took um, enough damage to be in serious danger, but that's not a problem. But yeah, this thing, whenever it attacks, it has a chance of breaking the physical shield. So, as much as it seems useless that you, that, um, as useless as it is that to cast a physical shield, I do still recommend it, because 16, 15 damage over 30 to 40, that's, uh, that's a pretty big difference there. So, yeah, that's, that's all I'm gonna say. But you still need to make sure that your party is fully healed, so casting a shield spell without having it be to all members kinda sucks. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, that kinda sucks. Freaking eight. Attacks freaking five times as well. That's full malaki. That attack attacks all the all the enemies at once. If there's more than one enemy, so bear that in mind. And GSP, that's it. healing up. Uh, Rainbow, not 
Beta, use that one. Jump machine gun, that's fine. Use a freeze on it as well. Foggy is key, that's fine. Pension to go go, ladies! When you know it, a Yuka crit finished the job! <laughs> Okay, um, interesting thing. I have not gotten a crit except for this and Alice. So, this is kind of weird to me that this kind of crit just ended the battle, but at the same time, it's also in that boss battle, and I'm, not, and I'm getting the, the crit scene from, but whatever. We won the battle, we got it. Objective complete. What? Um, what? Iku! You crept into us earlier. You owe us a brand new spaceship. <laughs> you don't mind. Uh-huh. Porky. Porky? Causing destruction here? Ah, oh. Come on. Destruction? Didn't even give us a chance to refill our energy, and Iku is already on our butts here. So, I guess there's another boss time, I guess. Um, oh joy, I need to heal Iku up pretty quickly here. So, we're gonna face off against Iku. Huh? Ouch. Ooh, ouch, that actually kinda hurt. Hang on there, Marissa. I'll heal you right up. Thankfully, Marimu... Oh, no, she doesn't. Oh, shit! Oh, that hurts. Ah, that hurts. That's not good. If Marimu doesn't go before Iku, then that's not fully good. So, yeah. Marimu is stuck on healing duties. It's only because of how much we kind of need her to be on healing duties, because you see the damage that she's bringing out, and holy crap, that's not that good. Hey, bad guys! It's your death day! Ooh, not bad. So that was our crit. Interesting. What? <laughs> what do you know? Another crit to another boss! Wow! <laughs> well, that's pretty great. But yeah, EQ is not that hard a boss. You just gotta keep up with the HP and whatever. So, yay, we win again! You got the bomb! Damn it! EQ! Maybe not, but... Oh well. Oh. Great. Oh. Freaking great. 
So, not only did Iku just knock us to freak out, but Tsuno went out of her way to put us into a freaking bad spot. Freaking fantastic. Yeah, what about that flying? You want to fly out of here? Sure, Yuka. Sure. Sure, let's get back home. You guys just gonna sit here and look at me? So, sake, sake, and curry. We'll get right on that. Great. So, now this enemy is blocking our way. We're down to little to no energy. <sighs> well, sh well, you're looking at water! Literally, literally, water is right behind you. Fire us up, you... Ah. Uh. Um, yeah, I'm thinking about it. Well, poo. All we got to eat left is the medicinal mushrooms that Marissa got. Great. Well, I guess we're stuck with this then, aren't we? <sighs> well... Hey, at least that's why everyone's facing a different direction. Huh. Neat. Oh, well. So, yeah, we kind of got ourselves in a bad spot. Thanks to Iku being not so explanatory, and Cerno being a butt and pushing us off a cliff. So, yeah, I guess we're kind of boned for now. So, I guess next time we're going to eat some mushrooms, rest up, and hopefully we'll find a way out of here and actually get back to where we're supposed to be. I don't even know where we're supposed to be going at this point. Were we supposed to be, like, like, finding monsters to beat? I don't know. I forgot what we were doing. I forgot what we're doing now. So, we're just going to end this one here. So, with that said, this is Gibatu. And until we have some medicinal lunch... Goodbye to you. You can sense the reluctance of that. Anyway, laters!